Well, it's that time of year again. That's right. It is the time for Christmas Martini 2022. This is the third year in a row that we're running the annual now, annual YouTube Christmas Martini Cocktail Challenge. And basically, this is just a challenge uh, to make a cocktail, uh, a martini cocktail, Christmas themed, post it online on YouTube or Instagram or TikTok or wherever. And there's no winners, no losers. It's just create as many awesome cocktail recipes as we can. This challenge is brought to you by myself, uh, Rob from Rob's Home Bar, but also by my good friends Vino from 60 Second Cocktails and Dave from Booze on the Rocks. Um, as I mentioned, this is the third year in a row. If you're new to this, you search on YouTube, search for Christmas Martini 2020 and Christmas Martini 2021. You're gonna find a whole bunch of recipes from various uh, cocktail creators on YouTube and as well as some on Instagram and eh, probably a, little, a few on TikTok as well. And But this is, uh, like I said, year three, so we're bringing it back. So let's break down the rules for this challenge. Rule number one, you gotta use a martini glass. This is the Christmas martini challenge. So not the Christmas old fashioned challenge, use a martini glass. Rule number two, make it festive. That can mean anything. That can mean using festive ingredients. That can mean um, using kind of a fun festive garnish. Doesn't matter, make it festive. And rule number three is easy. When you post it online, simply use the hashtag Christmas Martini 2022. That way it'll group all the videos or the posts together and everyone can join in on the fun. All right, so can't wait um, to see what everyone comes up with this year. And just to show you how easy it is, I literally threw this recipe together like 20 minutes ago when I filmed it. It's actually super late uh, the day before we wanted to release this video. So I did this absolutely last minute and here it is. Um, don't even have a fancy name for this one. Just calling it the Strawberry Candy Cane Martini. So there it is. We're gonna dump in a little bit of gin, two ounces of gin. We've got an ounce of my homemade strawberry liqueur. We then have half an ounce of peppermint schnapps. That's right, you can use chem amount, but I like peppermint schnapps better. Um, and then a couple dashes of cherry bitter. You have strawberry bitters, might even work better. But there it is, we're just going to stir that up and then we're gonna pour it, of course, into our martini glass. And I realized before recording this that I had not yet bought any kind of Christmas candy. So I had no candy canes laying around or, um, or anything like that. But you have to imagine that through some awesome Christmas magic, Christmas miracle, um, a festive garnish would appear magically just like that. It's a Festivus miracle! So there it is, my uh, strawberry candy cane martini. It, um, the gin is what I'm getting off the nose. These glasses are so huge, by the way. Ooh. So I do get the gin, obviously, as the base, but the main flavor that's hitting is the, the peppermint from the peppermint schnapps. It's really candy cane. But you do get a little bit, even though it was a full ounce of a strawberry liqueur, you do get a bit of strawberry on the back at the, on the finish, which is really nice. Um, so while it's not probably not like the, the most sophisticated or the fanciest concoction, I'd say this one's a winner. It's not bad. So it's just that easy. As you can see, I made this up literally 20 minutes ago. Just that easy to enter the challenge. You got the three rules, put them up on the screen once again. If you want to use any of the, um, logos and stuff that we've created. I'll have a link down there where you can download that. You can add it to your own video or your own post, whatever. And there it is. Let's see what everyone comes up with. Merry Christmas. Cheers. <laughs>